Well, what was once known as the Drug and Gang Summit has taken up a new name with the hopes of bringing a more positive outlook to the drug and gang issues on the Red Lake Reservation. Reporter Destiny Wiggins visited Red Lake Nation College today for the start of a three-day event that addresses these issues. For years, the Red Lake Nation has dealt with a large number of gangs, drugs, suicide, and violence. But today marked the three-day start of a community who wants to make a change and see a difference. The chemical health programs and Oshki Majitara um, come together to organize this event um, so we can focus on the recovery efforts that are happening in our area. Um, so we really wanted to focus on the positive things that are happening and um, try to get the word out there and um, just educate people about what's going on. And the community wellness gathering, a return to tradition, focuses on the idea for change within the community, as well as providing solutions and opportunities that can potentially improve lives. Recovery's always been here, but we I want to be more out there in recovery and give the community hope since there's always talk about drugs and alcohol, um, death, deaths from overdoses. And we just want, like we said before, we just want to send that message of hope. The three-day event consists of keynote speakers who tell their personal stories and various breakout sessions that focuses on recovery, culture, wellness, and healthy lifestyles. The most important thing is that, you know, as a, as a trainer facilitator, I come in to share, but you take what you need and, um, and what you don't, you could leave or share with someone else, but that they walk with, because it's kind of like, you know, when you get that aha moment, then it really sticks. Now you're ready to really create that change for yourself and allow. It kind of says that, you know, this is who I am, you know, because we, we went for, for a while in life where uh, we forgot about that part. So now we're bringing it back to them. And you can see the, the spark in them when they start learning, you know. You can see the spark in them when they understand who they are. You know, that, that they're, they're not this person, you know, looking like an Indian, looking like a native. You know, they have more to it. There is more to it than that. This event turns out to be a huge success every year. And the goal is for participants to take what they've learned and apply it in their everyday life. Reporting in Red Lake, Destiny Wiggins, Lakeland News. The event continues tomorrow with additional breakout sessions and will end with a closing ceremony on Friday. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.